Okay guys, so what we're gonna do is talk about how to properly denoise low light footage from the Mavic. So what you wanna do first is to take your clip and go ahead and apply neat video to it. I've already done that here. And what you wanna do is just select to open it and we're gonna load our profiles. Okay, so from, from here, what you wanna do is just load your profile. I have several that I'm testing right here. Yours will be cleaned up a little bit more. Um, you want to go to match whatever ISO you are at and also the resolution. So this was ISO 3200 at 4K. And when you do this, you're not going to notice any difference until you come over to your noise filter settings. And once you come here, it's going to sort of apply a preset. Um, and this is just the default settings for noise reduction. So what you want to do from here is come in and go to this 4K low light. Now when we apply this, what it does is it sets everything that just to be optimized for this particular ISO setting. So there's gonna be some post sharpening added to the image. If I click this and let go, you can see this is the before and after. And the post sharpening is necessary to bring back a little bit of that detail that can get lost from the heavy noise reduction that we're doing. And you can see right here it's cleaned up, but the problem is that the Mavic at 1600 and 3200 ISO has a lifted blue channel. You can kind of see that here, all around here. So you want your noise reduction to be processed first before any other color correction. So Final Cut 10 processes from top to bottom. So you load in whatever you're gonna to use to load your LUT. I'm using Color Finale Pro. Then I'll open that. I have a Mavic folder, and right here I have this Mavic 3200 ISO log. Now, you're, now log, um, log will, will not work for anything shot in any other profile. So I'll make one for D-Cine like too but um, these are gonna apply really to negative one contrast settings. Anything more than that, you'll want to dial it back a little bit. So you can see when I apply this, there. And now we have a nice looking image. 